What's going on guys? My name's Adrian. And I am Alberto. And we are the, the Outland Brothers. Brothers. Let's go! It's a grouse. You got it? Yeah. Flash! Jump, dude! Let's go! Nice! Let's go! Nice! No, 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 dog, dog's down there. No, no, no. Good girl. Yeah! Yeah! Let's go! Got it! Yeah! Got it! Got it! You got it? Oh, you hit it. That was you. Good job. Good girl. It's gonna be a woodcock in here. Good boy. Thank you. It's a big one too. Working it? Wow. Yeah. That a boy. It flew right up, but I have my gun right in the bottom here. Treating a rabbit. I like to girl. Oh. Ow. No, you got it. Good boy. Stick around and we want to show you how we were successful grouse hunting in the northern woods. Wait, 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 we forgot. We're giving this or this to our subscribers at the end of the video. Subscribe. We all know the feeling. We've been waiting all year long. The time has come to chase the king of the upland, the rough grouse. He's 40 yards up. Yeah. Yeah, right now, right now we're outside of the cut. Oh, she's just birdie. Let's go! Boy, you hit him hard. You gotta get a 20 gauge gun, bro. So why don't we, look, work this edge, just the edge of the woods that we're gonna work down. Let's do it. One of the best things about hunting grass and woodcock in Maine, is the memories that are formed between my brother and I. Point, point up ahead. In inside, inside. Come on, come on. I see her. Take the right, you take the right. This could be a grouse. You get in there and try to flush it. Get in front of her. Get in front of her. Right. Front of her. Walk up! Let's go! You killed him, right? Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Woo! Guys, second woodcock in here already in like five minutes. And we're just, we're so hyped right now. It's insane. Ah, the girl. girl. Good girl, fetch. Oh. Hey. 
Do you shoot with the top barrel again? No. Second woodcock. This is a big nice, one. Nice, bro. That's, that was a big bird. I thought it was a grouse. Later that day, right before sunset, we encountered five more grouse. Flush! Two flushes this way. Are you kidding me? Unfortunately, that encounter led to zero bird. But as we were headed back to the cabin, we encountered four more grouse. Three of them ended up in That's my like bag. That's like five. So they're coming on the roads at night. Here. End of the day, they love to come out to the road. Dang it. So that was another bird that flushed That was a flush for sure. So we got a mark. That's down. That's down. Oh yeah. Let's go, bro. Girl. Let's go. Girl, Good girl. Dada. Oh. Let's go, bro. Let's go. let's go try to get the other one. Laila, yo. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yo. Nice. We know there's two more birds up ahead, so we brought our friend Lila to point him down. There's two. There's two. He's looking right at me. Bro. Yo, I'm still there, what? Yo, I'm still holding down. I, I never shot it. I shot it, so let's see. Good girl. Good girl. Fetch, fetch. Ah, let's go! Let's go! Lila, here! Lila! Let's go, girl! Let's go! Go, girl! Go, girl! Ow, ow! Go, girl! Bro, 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 let's go! This, this, yeah, that was good. Bro! Atta girl. Atta girl, Lila. This is a beautiful bird if you want to mount it. So if you want to mount one bird, this one is it right here. We ended our first day with three grouse and two woodcock, and we found out what they were feeding on. Sugar maple seeds. So in the next video, we found lots of success targeting sugar maple trees. However, we also found out something else needed to be present for the grouse to be consistently there. To show our appreciation, we are giving away this lanyard that we used to count our flushes in Maine, and one of these orange hats showing up your gun dog breed. To enter, make sure to comment below and be subscribed. Also click on this video for some amazing quail hunting.